Well, Terrence, thanks for hopping on. Um, I guess, can I just have you introduce yourself, um, your background, your age, what, what you can sort of do for a living? Yeah. Um, so, um, yeah, my name is Terrence. Uh, I now just started an engineering role at my job. Um, been working there for about 20 years um, and just kind of got into trading accidentally. Um, found out that I had some shares under my account um, and it had a lot of dividend. Someone gave me a tip on uh, a, a stock and a few months, uh, about six months later, I, I, I saw it growing, played with that, made a good amount of money, kept playing with it, um, not knowing exactly what I was doing. And I lost a lot, actually. And that was when I kind of like just uh, told myself, well, I should take the time to learn this instead of just doing it blindly. And then um, I, I started to look into like day trading and stuff like that. I, I, I found you through social media actually first, mm. um, but I didn't um, pull the trigger just yet. Um, I don't know if you remember like the ad with your dad on it. Mm, um, yeah. yeah. That, that actually caught my attention because, you know, as a father, um, I was kind of, I was like, man, you know, this is something that I would want to teach my son as well. And I could see you like just um, the results that you made from it. And it, it, it just grew an interest for me. Um, but I also ran into another one, uh, which was more about day trading. And um, that actually taught me a lot about the market itself and, you know, like institutional um trades and how to ride with it and all that stuff uh and you know it for the most part it's it's uh it 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 works for a lot of people but just not for what i was doing um like, like i mentioned earlier with my new engineering role um it was a lot more demanding i didn't have that free time that i once did so i, I couldn't sit there and day trade I'm, I'm in the west coast too so um i'd, I'd have to start really early for that and, only had so much time. So it wasn't working out. Um, I didn't make anything actually. Like I was just, I, I, I didn't lose a lot either, but I, I, I spent a lot on tools and, and trying to learn it, which I think is, is, is valuable now. Um, so then when I started to realize like, this isn't for me, and then I, I remember your ad and I went back to my emails and I, I actually used those. I was like, man, I'm, kind of thankful that you kept like sending me emails because I, I was able to find you right away. And um and then I met with um with with Eric um said I told him the same exact story that I'm telling you now. And he just kind of um you know he set me up and he sounded really confident in what I was looking for and how it could help me. And um like on my part there was no skepticism. It was just like I I I was kind of eager to see, you know, um, how, how soon this could be helpful. And um, I've, I've only been with you for um, literally just a month last Friday. And um, I, 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 was, I, was, I was getting my spreadsheets and all of the moves that I, I've made a total of about um, seven moves with you, right? Um, and I, I, I didn't have much to play with because, you know, I, I, I was stuck on a trade. I, I still had my shares with whatever. So I don't have that much capital. But, um, man, I, I when, when I'm putting up these numbers, I'm like, it, I, I averaged about a little uh, like 4.4%, which doesn't sound much, but a lot. Uh, that's a it's lot of the world. Yeah. It's a lot. Yeah. And 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 Eric was like when when I told him that that my goal was just, oh, just, you know, just maybe two to three thousand dollars a month extra would be nice, you know what I mean? Just to kind of pay off some of, of the bills and, and live comfortably. And then I looked at it and it's it is exactly about that. Just between two to three thousand. I have about um twenty six hundred plus um from all of your moves. Uh, I've I've made some like what I told Eric last last week, I made some rogue plays, um, but it, I, I didn't lose a lot from it. But um, but I've, I've kind of learned to just you know um, temper some some of my uh, em emotions with it and ideas. But yeah, just putting 
just putting all the numbers together, I'm just super confident. And um, again, with your guidance, I was able to have more capital now. And um, with that said, uh, just within one play, which is like the one that you helped me with or helped everyone with last night, um, I'm I'm already like more than half of what I earned last month was just that okay. one play. And that's literally just like a day after the month anniversary of me joining you. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. So in total, in terms of total gains that you've got since one month since being with us, how much did you say that was? It was uh, over 2,600. Over 2,600. Very yeah. nice. How much are you, capital are you playing with right now? Um, right now, well, with with that twenty six hundred, I was I was playing with about twenty five to to thirty k capital. Okay. Um, yes. But but right now it's 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 a lot more, um, which okay. is why I was able to make almost half of that in one play. You know. Beautiful. Yeah. So what I got was pretty fresh to stock market. You did a couple courses in the past or mm -hmm. day trading. Ended up. Being successful for others, for you specifically, due to the demand with work or whatever it may be, it wasn't for you. Didn't lose a lot of money, but ended up uh, just wasn't really going anywhere. You right. ended up in the program and things have been finally, the needle's been finally moving. Right. So, awesome. Exactly. Very nice. Exactly. In terms of uh, the, I guess, the time impact now, can you sort of compare and contrast what it was before to what it is now? Um, you mean as, as far as trading in, in general? Yeah. Like just um, how, so, yeah. How like crazy year. Yeah. Yeah. It was, uh, be, before, you know, you, you had to be on live with the stock market, with the day trading, and you have to really see when, you know, how, how, how the market's playing out, especially if you're dealing with like four different options or whatever, mm -hmm. um, or four different types of sectors, but it, it's, um, it required a lot of attention. Now it's just more of like. You know, I kind of chime in and to see what you're sharing with the group, and um, I'm 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 in every single call that 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 you host every Thursday. Like those are the most educational ones. Um, very very helpful. And usually after those calls, I'm usually like confident in in making a new move. But as far as the time that it takes to do it, it's it's uh, it's very little. It's very little. Like I um I I, I kind of know um um what i'm going to get in like which position to get into i, I already have an idea i have an idea of, of the entry with with your help um so i, I kind of just set those markers and sometimes i'll just wake up and be like oh look i'm in position today oh look i have profit today so it's it's very um much less time i think the time that i'm putting into it now is just more of like just time that i want to put into it you know what i mean like i'm more interested in you know like setting up like the trend lines that 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 you've shown us and where the demand said like exactly how you taught us like i'm I'm just kind of finding myself looking for more things um on, on my own just like what you've encouraged to do so yeah it's a lot more free time was definitely here yeah can you speak about some of the things you learned throughout the program or just like how valuable it was just since joining or just your knowledge gained since for one month yeah. ago? So um, going into, well, coming from day trade, I've, I've, I've learned like a, a, a lot of my moves were emotional, right? And, um, and, 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 that, and that carried on with you, except the difference with your strategy is that uh, you don't have to worry about a stop loss or, or a fake out just blowing your, your, your trade. It's more of just, you, you, and, and you preach that to us every single day, be patient, it's all emotional trust in these uh undervalued stocks they're 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 chosen for a reason like you've done the um data or you've done the research um and 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 that kind of trust and 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 that kind of data um did help me with the conviction of the position that i enter in um that uh if if, if anyone's ever listening to this is probably the most important thing because you know you're you're just watching your money and you know, keeping it's I'm I'm learning to not stare at the screen for it too much and just kind of know and trust where it's gonna go and know what my exit points are. 
Um, and that's probably the most valuable. It's just um, patient, but you don't even have to be like that patient. Like yeah, I'm, I'm one, one, cause I have my dates set here. Like the longest that I've waited, um, 10 days, right? That's mm -hmm. the longest. Uh, I've, I've, I've had some plays here that were done within the same day. Um, and I, th th those 10 days may have seemed like forever, but actually that the, 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 uh, 10 day one is actually my largest, um, profit yeah. as as interest goes, which is why, like I told you earlier, um, you may have closed out on a position. I forgot it because I was out and about and I, I couldn't close it, but I'm not even worried. Like you're like telling me now, yeah, you can still close it right now. I'm like, that's fine. You know, like I, it's, yeah. it grows, it grows. If it, if it doesn't I'll just wait a little bit longer. And that's, that's the beauty of it. When I was sort of in the beginning of trading and I did day trading options, all that kind of stuff, I was following signals at the very beginning too. And for them, it's like, if you don't enter, in the same time as them if you don't edit the moment they exit that's the difference between profiting or just being not profitable in their positions right, right. where with like this you're buying in such a very oversold area that even if you don't sell when i'm saying i'm selling out of the positions right. these are so undervalued for the long-term perspective that no matter what you're you will likely become out of this significantly profitable right right exactly and um and 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 in that same breath, um, before I I joined you, I I kind of told you I was kind of stuck in a in, in a video trade, right? Kind of bought it too high, and then I, I said, well, I I could have panicked and and sold it and let my emotions just kind of sell it for a loss as well. But it's it's picked up a lot, mm -hmm. and um, you know, being with you kind of just taught me to be more patient with it, mm -hmm. and that patience has. Save me probably seven to ten G's right there. But um and and who knows, probably even profit from it later on. But very, very happy to hear. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Can you share um, you dealt a little bit about the emotions? Can, can you go over the emotions between before and like now, I guess? Yeah. So um like I was kind of telling you, I, I kind of got into this accident, right? And I saw the profit and I put in money into some stocks which i thought was good and um blindly went in it and actually made a good amount but i was um i at, at first i was i was getting greedy i was holding on to it too long um to the point where i'd only win a little bit and then you know went into another stock and then thinking that i bought low but it was it was a, it was a tesla stock actually um it was around April. I don't know if you remember around that time when, when the market was kind of taking a dip or, or correction. Um, I thought I got it at a good price and I did. It was like around 164 or something like that. But it kept dipping and it kept getting lower. And my emotions got to me like I um, just kind of like, oh, well, that's a huge loss. And I was like, I might as well, you know, sell now before it gets even worse. And then um probably lost around oh gosh um i want to say around seven seven k on 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 that and then just a few weeks later it just like ramped right back up and i'm just i was just like beating myself up and and that yeah. you know that's that's when i was like well i i, <laughs> I probably should take the time to learn got it and was was that an option play or an equity play like stock? um that was an equity play uh, yeah, yeah. If only you met me sooner. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> awesome. Absolutely. Yeah, I yeah. was thinking that the whole time. Thanks for sharing that. Can you go a little bit more about your experience throughout this program? Would you recommend this program to others? Absolutely. Um, kind of feels like a, a like a like a like like a well kept secret on 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 how to. Um, I, I guess like the cheat code in in in, in yeah, the stock market. Yeah, everyone's afraid to um, you know lo lose their money, and uh, rightfully so, right? A, a lot of people worked hard for their money. A, a lot of people invested a lot, and you know took a lot of time for their um, um, for their assets to grow. So, from my experience with this one is, um, as mentioned earlier, 
the stuff that you're playing with or the positions that you're getting into um, are 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 well researched um, and you know I trust you completely I mean I'm I'm, I'm seeing you know just um, literally paying dividends of the moves that you've advised us to do so my experience with it is you know you you like for the person who's getting into it that don't know anything about stocks it's you make it super simple by saying hey i'm going in at this price this is the demand and you even tell them when you're exiting so there's nothing more easier than that um if you want to um even with the little knowledge that I know, like I feel like I can, you know, look at demand and, and set trend lines and, and all that stuff. Um, I could, I'm still learning a lot from you in regards to like being patient and, you know, when, when to not miss the ride and when not to be greedy. Like those are very valuable things. So um, I, I, I feel confident um, in, um, uh, to the point where I, increase my capital to put more into it you know so I'm, I'm 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 putting my money where where my confidence is which kind of relies on you awesome terrence um what are your goals by the way like what's sort of are you aiming for a certain amount per month what what's your overall financial goals um well my first financial goals um like when i was talking to eric about it it was just kind of just a um kind of offset some bills and just allow me to have more freedom to um you know use whatever money to just spend time with, with with the kids or um pay off debt right um but i think now um well that that's that's still in place um but i think now it's just i want to teach my two sons um this 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 trade and teach them how to be more financially independent um and 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 kind of just you know use the money to to help um like for me I'm, I'm i'm using it to help like my family members you know what i mean and um and right now my son's going to school college too kind of you know using that as well so i I guess to be financially free, just like most people, and um, be able to have the freedom to use, you know, um, the money to go on vacation or um, spend time together more, go out together more. Very nice. Do you think you're on your way there so far? Oh yeah, yeah, most most definitely. Yeah, I mean, with um, when, when when I had the call with with Eric last. Uh, last week and i was just realizing it's been a month and i put the numbers together i was like let's let's go out to you know yeah. celebrate and went out for like a nice dinner and treated them out with some things just just because we could very nice very nice well terrence thanks so much for offering your thoughts on the whole program so far yeah I'm, thank you so much yeah no problem anytime i'm extremely excited for your progress and hopefully we do this again in a in a couple months see where things are Looking forward to it. Can't awesome, wait. Thanks. Take care. All right, of All right. Take it easy. You too.